Right, we have a question here on contraception. It says a woman does not want to become pregnant. She considers two methods of contraception and we need to draw the line for each method and how it prevents pregnancy. So first we have a condom which basically prevents the sperm from reaching the egg because it's a barrier method. And second, we have an oral contraceptive, which is known as the pill. So what the pill does is it contains hormones, estrogen and progesterone. The estrogen causes the woman to have a very high estrogen level. High estrogen levels is not good if you want to get pregnant. It does the opposite. It's because what it does is it also inhibits the release of FSH, follicle stimulating hormone. So what FSH is meant to do is cause the egg to grow and mature so that it can be released. But because the estrogen in the pill causes the woman to have very high estrogen levels, it inhibits or it stops FSH from being released. And if you don't have FSH, that means the egg is not going to mature and be released. So that's how you prevent the pregnancy. So the answer here is the hormones, i.e. estrogen, stops the eggs from maturing. Part two of this question says, give one advantage and one disadvantage of taking oral contraceptives to prevent pregnancy. So this is like taking the pill. Advantage of it is very easy to take. There's no doctors required for it. So advantage is easy to take. You can also say it's very reliable and you don't need to rely on the partner doing anything there. Disadvantage is you need to remember to take it on the right days. You could also say it causes side effects and you can also say it doesn't prevent STDs. Any one of those will get you the mark there. So I'm going to write could cause side effects.